Hi, I'm Sam Carson for the NCSU Weather Center, and I'm here bringing you your forecast updates. Okay, so we got headlines for today. The first one, um, we're going to take a look at the tropical activity, um, see if there are any named storms uh, in the Atlantic <clears throat> that would affect our area. And then we have uh, cooler temperatures coming in um, later in the week. Um, and also, finally, we have um, a weekend shaping up to be really nice. <clears throat> But first, we're going to take a look at our class-by-class -class forecasts. Um, 8 o'clock today, we're going to have mostly sunny skies with a temperature around 60 degrees. Um, but by lunchtime, it's going to warm up all the way up to 72. Again, mostly cloudy skies, but finally clearing um, around 3 o'clock um, by, you know, by the beginning of your last class um, to a temperature around the mid-70s. <clears throat> now, we, we're going to look at the satellite image, and we're going to talk about the tropical activity. There is a disturbance um, in the western Atlantic. Um, it shouldn't really affect the Raleigh area too much. Um, it's going to move north and northward over the next few days. Even if it becomes a named storm, um, it shouldn't affect, have any effect um, on us. Um, but you can see all the cloud cover we've, we've had today and um, probably move on out um, towards the east over the next couple of days. Um, but these are keeping the temperatures a little bit lower than what they could be this time of year. Um, and you can see by the surface map, um, this is where all the cloud cover was. Um, we have a low that's developing here um, off the coast um, that's also got some precip ahead of it. Um, but what's going to be affecting us um, later on in the week is this cold front here. And you can see it's going to move down by tomorrow um, over to Kentucky and West Virginia. Um, but ahead of that, we have clear skies after that low off the coast is, is moved further east. Um, but again, it's going to be um, a great weekend um, with these cooler temps. Um, but for today, we're just going to have um, a high around 80, uh, mostly sunny skies. It's going to be hot and humid. Um, and the winds, we're not really going to see uh, much of those at all. going to be pretty calm out there. Um, but tonight, um, it, gets, it gets pretty cool. Um, drops down to the upper 50s. Um, it's going to be mostly clear skies again. Um, winds, no problem at all. Um, but tomorrow, it warms up to about the same temperature, low 80s, um, mostly sunny skies. Um, not as humid, though. Um, the winds are going to be calm, increasing um, slightly through the day to about 5 miles per hour from the south, so it's going to be a little bit warmer. Um, <clears throat> and look at the week ahead. Um, we have um, Wednesday, um, mostly sunny skies um, with highs in the low 80s. Um, and pretty much it, it stays that way through, through the next couple of days as well, um, except the um, clouds increase um, Thursday and then on Friday as well, becoming mostly cloudy. Um, and then we have um, so, some showers that will um, come in um, Friday night um, and into Saturday, um, dropping the temperature down. Um, with that cold front um, that's bringing um, the mid to lower 70s um, on Saturday and Sunday. But it's going to be a beautiful weekend, um, especially if you're traveling down to Clemson um, to watch NC State um, take on the football team there. Um, <clears throat> and so you can also check out um, NCSU Weather on Facebook and um, Twitter pages um, and also um, find any of the videos here um, on NCSU Weather at YouTube. Uh, thank you, and have a good day.